what's up guys um I did a video yesterday and it didn't turn out so well it's this one right here um the video was good but the audio quality wasn't so I ended up hooking my turtle beaches up to my computer so that my mic quality was 20 times better okay so I'm gonna go over this again um if you watched the first one and couldn't understand me then it's probably because you couldn't hear me. But anyway, this is the website that uh, T-Mobile has posted on their forum by uh, an administrator um, that the Froyo 2.2 update for the MyTouch slide is here. It was uh, released yesterday. Um, let's see. Well, I got the text about it yesterday. I don't know exactly when it was released. It says it was released. Um, I don't know. Some somewhere in March, late March, early April, that it was actually um for in installation. But I don't know because uh, I just got text about it yesterday. Okay, so what you're gonna need to do is um. If you want this on your phone, it's not an over the air, over the air update, which means that it's not going to come straight to your phone through the network towers. Okay, so you have to download it on your computer. Your computer has to be Windows. Um, the operating system has to be Windows XP, Service Pack 2, or above. Um, this fixes all of these things right here, which is Android 2.2, well it don't fix it, but it, you know what I mean, it gives you Wi-Fi calling, Wi-Fi hotspot, USB tethering, uh, low storage notification mechanism, which it had that anyway, but it must be an updated version, I haven't got to play with it much, so I don't know, uh, it resolves issues with the text and picture messaging, which, it did change the interface of the text messaging um, application, so, You'll be noticing that after you download this. Um, I can put a video up of the actual phone if you guys want to. If you guys want me to. Just uh, comment or send me a message about that. And it fixes uh, re reliability of the device and uh, minor bugs and fixes. So what you want to do first is uh, download download two things from this website here which is going to be in the description it's the HTC website um, you're going to need to download and save to your desktop make sure you save it to your desktop um, the first one is HTC sync 3.0.5511.exe file so that here's the website I've already got it pulled up you're going to need to download this this is it right here the HTC sync 3.0 and uh, I'll show you how to do that real quick. You're going to need to download, um, save file. Once it once it's done or whatever, you need to uh, you need to save it to your desktop. Um, and we'll cancel. But anyway, you need to save that to your desktop. And then you need to go back and you need to download the uh, actual Android 2.2 system update, which is this one right here. Okay, and then you just need to download that and then once you download them to your desktop this is gonna show up and this is gonna show up this is the sync right here you're gonna need to run that first and then uh, this is the Android 2.2 software okay so once you download it you, the first thing you need to do when you get to here is double click on these HTC sync it's gonna mine has security settings so you need to click yes but I'm gonna click no because I already have it and it's gonna bring up the wizard to install this you need to install it you need to click next um, and install it onto your computer once you do that it's gonna bring up this you don't need to touch any of this anymore the only thing you need to do is plug in your device or your my touch 3g slide uh, via USB and um, need to make sure it's on the home screen of your of your um, my touch 3g slide like this but with the home screen okay and then you need to 
disable your um, whatever this is your virus protection and then you need to because if you don't it'll just ask you when you start to download this onto your phone it'll ask you to do it anyway so might as well get that out of the way okay so after you install that I'm just gonna read it straight off the internet um, then you click on the after it's plugged in you need to click on the T-Mobile My Touch 3G slide software update you need to double click on that which is this one here and double click on that mine's got the security settings so that thing's gonna pop up again but you need to do that run the wizard with your phone plugged in okay I, I can't really pull up the wizard right now but I can show you what it will look like this is the first thing that pops up it is uh, when the wizard appears click the box and click next so you click that you understand the caution indicated above and then you need to click next okay then ensure you have completed the, ste the steps listed check the box then click next turn on your Android phone and connect it to your PC using the USB cable provided uh, disable the standby and hibernation, hibernation modes on your PC and make sure that your battery power is more than 30% on your phone and on your computer of course but you know what I mean you need to click I have completed the steps and then next and then you want to confirm that, that that's what you're doing uh, that that you want to software upgrade from uh, these two which is 1.27 and 1.35 and then you need to click click um, the update button you need to confirm the update version uh, to 2.2 .2, which is what this is it don't say that exactly but that's what it is click next you need to uh, confirm by clicking next on these and then uh, this is where the if you don't have your virus protection this is where it's going to pop up that you need to turn it off so go ahead and turn that off up here before you even get to it um, this does take about 10 minutes something's going to pop up on your uh, on your phone it says HTC it's something that you've not seen before probably and don't worry about that that's just it's doing its thing and once this is a hundred percent done this will pop up and say congratulations your ROM has been updated completely completely and your Android phone is now ready for use click finish and then um, I waited a couple minutes to make sure everything was good and then uh, my phone came back on and uh, I have Android 2.2 on my my touch 3g slide alright guys um, if you guys have any questions just uh, comment or send me a private message and I'll be glad to answer them um, I guess that's it. Um, if you want a review of Android 2.2 on the MyTouch 3G slide, just also put that in the uh, comment section. Alright guys, uh, this is Jake with Sand TV, and I'm out.